Welcome to the iLinks 8.6 Feature Spotlight video for the iLinks Flex client. In 8.6, we've done a lot of work to give the Flex client a facelift, uh, modernize the user interface, and introduce access to a number of different areas of the product that weren't available before. So let me start with some of the facelift type of features. Uh, we've added the ability for users to select from a number of different out-of-the-box skins, uh, depending on um, you know, the color preferences. We've also added some streamlining for collapsing and maximizing uh, your screen real estate, which is very important because this client is fully supported on tablets and phones. And so having the ability to maximize that screen real estate is extremely important. So Flex has always had the ability to interact with iLinks content store documents. And so this version is no different. I can sort, I can right click, I can open these documents uh, in the viewer, access all of the metadata associated. I can also perform full uh, version control, check in, check out. I can update indexes. I can introduce new content into my system. I can do advanced searching, including full text searching. Uh, and structured searching. So very powerful ways to access your iLinks Content Store applications. We can also access iLinks Content Store views. So in this case, I'm going to run a view that's going to bring back invoices that are due in the next 30 days. And I have all of the interaction capabilities with my content returned from a view that I would just from browsing the application. In 8.6, we have also exposed the iLinks eForms into the iLinks Flex client. So public forms, secure forms. So I have the ability to browse the forms that are available to me based on security and fill out that form and submit that into iLinks Capture Workflow. Now, once it's in iLinks Capture Workflow, in 8.6, iLinks Flex has the ability to access capture views so that I can interact with in-flight workflows. And so in this case, I can click on the proposal review view and I see all of the items waiting for me to work in that queue. I can select one of those and it's going to open up that iLinks eForm for that batch that's in my workflow. So if the designer has chosen to make this editable. I have full access to modify this information in workflow using an eForm, and I can do this on my phone or on a tablet. In 8.6, another feature that we're very excited about is actually a new product called iLinks Analytics. iLinks Analytics allows you to create dashboards that surface information about iLinks Capture, Content Store, eForms, and even external data. And so within iLinks Flex, I can see my dashboards that I've been granted access to. I can interact with these dashboards and um, really explore the information that's shown to me. And this is particularly highlighted here if I'm using a grid control. So I can grab some of these columns and I can drag and drop and I can do sorting and grouping. And if I get this presented in the way that I, I want, I can click the download button and download this full report as a PDF. The dashboards have some really nice theming capabilities as well. You can see we've got donut charts, pie charts, area charts, line charts, uh, bar graphs, uh, and report grids. So very powerful widgets to display data from all of the iLinks products, capture, eForms, content store, uh, and even external data. So we're very excited about the 8.6 iLinks Flex client. Keep on the lookout for additional feature spotlight videos. Thank you.